Hey guys, welcome back. If you saw our first video, which was just me doing a quick five minute makeup video, um, my name is Nikki. This is my fiance, Chelsea. <laughs> and I've been wanting to do YouTube for literally years. I've been talking to Chelsea about it the entire year and almost a half that we've been together. And I finally got her on board. So the way we're going to do this video is she is going to do my makeup. She watches me do my makeup almost every time that I do it. Anytime that we're going anywhere, she'll sit there with me. So she's going to do it for me. And then we're also going to kind of introduce ourselves, talk to you about what we do, why we want to do YouTube, um, and just kind of who we are. So if you want to hang around and watch Chelsea do my makeup, here we go. And we'll also introduce you to another member of our family. Say hi, Basil. Say hi. Look. <laughs> Look. Say hi. <laughs> She'll sit between my legs, I'm sure, throughout the entirety yeah, of the video. Literally the whole time. I'm going to put this on first. <clears throat> Keep all your hair out of your face. I've already washed my face, toned, moisturized, the whole nine yards. Put <laughs> your ears out? Yes, please. <laughs> <clears throat> okay, so, and I'm going based off of what I think I'm supposed to do. So I'm going to use this first, which is Wet n Wild Primer Water. Okay. This, I think. I'm not going to tell you yes <laughs> or no. So this is, we also went to several different stores for her one day just to be able to find this. But it's the Makeup Revolution Concealer. Yeah, I think this one's right. The brushes are where I really, really struggle because I'm honestly not sure which ones go with which, but I think this is the right brush. <laughs> Tell them a little bit about you. So, I um, am a social worker, but I went to App State and graduated a couple years ago. Um, I did not start out as a social work major. Um, I actually wanted to be a police officer. Um, and then I did a ride along and that changed quickly. So I decided <laughs> that I was going to do psychology and also hated that too. Um, I'm one that really has to be really good at something. If I'm not really good at something, I honestly don't like it if I'm not good at it. And that was the case for psychology. So I um, actually had a friend who she was going to be doing some social work classes. And I just told her that I was going to go with her one day. And I did. And I fell in love with it. And so that's why I do what I do now. Um, I played sports literally my entire life. Soccer, basketball, volleyball. Um, I did a year of softball. Um don't make any mean jokes about that. <laughs> Out of the year of softball. Um, let's see. I don't know. I don't really know anything interesting about myself other than sports related. So I am also a social worker. That's how we met. We did meet where we work. Um, I also graduated from App State, but not at the same time that Chelsea did. We were there at overriding times, but not at the same time. Because we were in the expert training together. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> and we didn't even know clips. until it was funny because we didn't realize that until we started working together in May of 2018. We started dating in September of 2018, but we were in a training together at App State in August of 2017. Yeah, that's when the clips were. Um, I did know I wanted to be a social worker. I struggled with it a little bit in like community college. Shape tape. I'm honestly having a brain fart, and I'm not sure if I'm supposed to do this before this, but I think this comes first. <laughs> um, anyway, I'm almost out of this. So I graduated with my bachelor's degree in social work from Western Carolina University here in North Carolina, and I got my master's at App. So I do have my master's in social work. I have my LCSWA for all my social work friends out there who know what that means. Um, so while we both do work at the same agency, I also do therapy on the side, um, which I love. I did not play sports, but I was in band for seven years. I did color guard in the band. I was a cheerleader during uh, some of my middle school career, I did gymnastics when I was younger. I don't think this is right either.
Well, tell me about the most most interesting thing about I have two um, wonderful little kids, a four-year-old girl and a one-year-old little boy who are completely messes. <laughs> they take after their mom, so that makes sense. Okay. So I think now I'm going to use the Maybelline finishing powder. Now, the real deal breaker is going to be, are you going to wear this out? Are you going to feel comfortable enough that I've done a good enough job that you would Ooh, wear it out? So should that be part of it? So regardless of how you do and what it looks like, I'm going to wear it out. I don't think so, because I might be embarrassed. Okay, we'll have to see. <laughs> we'll have to see. We are going to be taking, um, so Chelsea's little sister is actually staying with us this weekend, and we're going to go to a music store here later today, because what was your Christmas party? A guitar. Mm -hmm. and guitar picks and a tuner which I've been wanting to learn how to play an instrument for a really long time um but honestly never well no one ever bought me one but also just because I never had the time I don't guess or I didn't feel like I had the time but I've been pretty interested in it for for a while now so but it is an older guitar so it's not a brand new guitar so we need to go get it restrained get it looked at make sure that it's in good working order because I got her a tuner to go with it but it doesn't necessarily seem to be staying in tune, so. Okay. <clears throat> I know I'm supposed to spray your face again, but I'm not really sure if I'm supposed to do that now. Yes or no? Wink once for yes or twice for no. <laughs> I hate you right now. <laughs> so I'm not going to spray it. So I'm going to use the Manizer Sisters. Honestly, the first time I ever saw Nicole with this, I thought it was hilarious, and I actually <laughs> thought it was a, a joke, but it's definitely <laughs> not, so. Okay. I think this is right. No. So which one are you using? Um, the Mary Lou Manizer, which is the one. I know it's kind of hard to see, but well, and I've used this one all the time for Is It Me? Okay, so I know that inner corner highlight is something that you do, but I don't think that that happens. Now this is the wrong brush. I'm not a hundred percent sure, so I'm just gonna use this one. Okay, am I glowing? Yes, come through highlight, okay. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> you do the eyes next and then you do the blush after, is what I think I'm supposed to do. Also, and obviously all of you probably will know who this is, but the Shane Dawson, the Mini Controversy Palette, um, which I have a dirty secret to tell that I actually watched every episode on YouTube <laughs> of this. Mm -hmm. Um, which I always usually make fun of Nicole because since I, it takes me like a fourth of the time to get ready that it does Nicole. She usually watches a YouTube video um, of someone else getting ready so that she can feel like someone's getting ready with her. So, um, but I was actually pretty interested in this and honestly, if I wore makeup, I probably would buy all of these things. Also, if we had the money to do that. Well, but. and we tried. We tried so hard and the only reason anybody who has actually watched the Shane Dawson Jeffree Star, you know, video series that they did, the mini controversy wasn't put up on the website at first, which is the only, only, only reason I even got my hands on this because by the time I got there, it was seven o'clock at night on the East Coast, but we were stuck at work. I was out on a home visit and I was stuck there for hours and hours and hours, completely forgot about it. I hate to even admit that, but I completely forgot about it. Got home, got the email from Morphe that said launches today and I about cried. I'm not even going to lie to you guys. I about cried. I immediately went on the website, all of them. I finally got my hand on the mini controversy, but was not able to get the full size conspiracy palette and that it'll come out near her birthday. So do you want to show them the one of the Christmas gifts that you got? Yes. So another thing that I did get from Jeffree Star, one of my favorite Christmas presents. So we've already done Christmas. Let's just be real. It's <laughs> December 22nd and we've already opened up all our gifts and we're done. But it was his Black Onyx hand mirror. Thanks. All right, you ready? Yes. I think I was talking earlier about 
trying to figure out what colors I wanted to use, and I think I'm going to use, um, this one's called Exposed, this one's Controversy, and then this one is Flat Earth. I wanted to go with something kind of bold, might as well go all out or nothing, mm -hmm. so <laughs> here goes nothing. And I think I'm supposed to do the dark on the inside and lighter on the outside, so close your eyes. I was president of my sorority in college um, for two terms, actually. Um, I don't do a lot with them now. Um, I was actually also a founding member, um, which if you don't, anyone doesn't know the lingo or what that means or um, really understand that, it means that when a sorority first comes onto a college campus, um, they have a lot of people that come out um, and kind of tell the campus about the sorority and then they'll accept it onto the campus if they decide to um, and then the first however many um, every campus is different but however many girls they let into the sorority um, that they are the founding members um, and so I've had some really great friends I hate that I'm not really in touch with a lot of the girls um, that I was founding members with now we still follow each other on social media and things like that but um, so yeah, I was I started out as property manager, and then um, our president had had actually stepped down. She went to another school, um, and so I was elected and was president for the rest of that term, and then an, another term. Um, I wish I could have done more. Obviously, I always say I don't think I was the best president that I could have been. Um, I could have been a lot better, mm -hmm. but I had a lot of um, stressful things. My grandfather was really sick throughout that process too, so there was a lot going on. But um, honestly it was one of the best experiences of my life um just being able to I got to travel a lot um rode on my first airplane um which was and I'm not I hate I'm afraid of heights and so she flying fly is not anywhere. My, I will fly I've flown a lot in the past but I just don't ever have a good experience and I just don't really like it that much and so um I told her when <clears throat> when and if we get to go on an extravagant honeymoon or whatever, that she'll just have to knock me out with a Xanax or something like yeah. that. But, okay. So, can I use the same brush? No. No? Okay. Let's get to that. I know I'm not supposed to tell her what to do, but I was not about to let her dip that dark purple into that, <laughs> that lilac. Okay. Despite my dad being in the Air Force throughout my childhood and into, you know, early preteen years, I've never flown on an airplane. My mom hasn't either. Which is really surprising. You would love it. Yeah, I, I'm that person who would absolutely love flying. I love to travel. I love to go here and there. I'm not afraid of heights. I'm not afraid. But then again, I'd probably be the one to the plane would crash because of that. I don't know what you guys can see, but it looks like I just punched the crap out of her. <laughs> this is what we have so far. You've actually not done an awful job at all. I've not done an awful job. <sighs> That's probably not like you are one bearing. You are in their eyeballs. <laughs> tickling my eyeballs. <laughs> I mean, truly, this is not this is not that bad. Okay. All right, I need another small brush. I might use it. Whoops, I'm gonna use this one. Another fun fact. That was your first fun fact. Um, I was also a resident assistant at App for three years. Three years. Um, so um, I also recognize that some people, a lot, of, not everyone went to a four-year college, um, which is totally fine. Um, but you may not understand or know what resident assistant is. Um, it's pretty much now that I'm older. It's pretty much like. You keep people from getting into trouble. That's what people think that it is, but there's a lot more to it. Um, I saw it more as like an educator, more as a, like a mentoring type program. Well, and the resident assistant is who stays over the dorms. Yeah, you stay at you, um, and it depends. Like I was in a, several different dorms at App. Um, I was in a different dorm every year that I was a resident assistant. Um, and you pretty much kind of mentor the, the younger people who come to live at the dorm. So you put on programs, you educate, um, on different things. And we're not going to get political on here, obviously, but just, um, teaching people that, um, important things that they need to know when going into the, into the real world, 
um, and things like that. I, I gained a lot of friends, um, fellow RAs and things like that who are all doing amazing things now. We actually um, just went to Disney earlier this year and we, we got did. to and I don't know one if of her he'll previous... see this or not, but Matt, hi, mm-hmm. we missed you, we love you. Um, but yes, he, he works at Disney now. Um, and so <clears> he was one of the best RAs that I worked with. I learned a lot from him. Um, but yeah, and he obviously loves it at Disney and I don't know if you guys love Disney, but we do. So Even we're hoping to once. take the kids soon and we want to go back mm-hmm. again by ourselves too, but I feel like I need to put a little bit more dark on your eyes. I don't feel like that's the greatest, and I don't even know if that's... I think you're doing fine, truly. We just need to clean up a little bit, but you know, we're fine. Look, you remember that little tip and trick that I taught Lara yesterday. So, again, some more information about us. Chelsea does have two half-siblings and four step-siblings? It's four. Four step-siblings. I have three half-siblings, one of which I'm really close to, two of which I'm not really close with. Unfortunately, they live out of state. How do I fix? Like, I feel like I have purple up here in your eyebrows. How do I fix it? So you actually brought the right thing to be able to do that. She brought some makeup remover wipes. Okay, so now that I've done that, I need to eyeliner mascara. Are you mascara? done with my face? No, I need to do blush. So I do that first. Anything else I do? Spray. Oh, inner corner I highlight. What do I do with my little chubby cheeks, though? Oh, contour. There we go. Usually you don't like use this? a glittery one. No. <laughs> There's so many brushes. I don't know. Oh, like a big one. That makes sense. So I'm helping her more than most people do with this, but you know what? It's fine. Okay. So I just like blush, right? No, not like this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. You're still doing it like blush. But it's okay. Keep going. I'm excited. Like that? <laughs> I think I'm I think I messed up. I love it. We're really getting somewhere now. <laughs> well, how am I supposed to do it? It's okay. When this is how you're you're doing it to the best of your knowledge, and that's what this whole video is about. Look at me. <laughs> How's it look? Oh, not the greatest. <laughs> Oh, you wouldn't hit on me if we were out in public and I look like this. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna do this any- that one anymore. Cause She's gonna leave one, one side contoured and one <laughs> side not contoured. Okay, well I'm trying to think about what. Honestly, though, it doesn't look. Some people do contour like that. Oh, I just don't. <laughs> Sorry, Basil. I just don't know what I'm supposed to do. Here. Mm-hmm. No, but it's okay. That. <laughs> There's not many other ways I can use the. <laughs> I thought you used it like that. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> love you too. Okay. Now, can I do the blush? Mm-hmm. Yes, you may. This is Tarte, and it's Risqué blush. It's one of her favorites. It's literally my favorite in the whole world. <laughs> Not so much as the look that I got from her. <laughs> Look at me. Your highlight is not popping, but you can always go back in. I don't even remember what I put highlight on to begin with. This one? <laughs> oh, no, no, no. It's this. That's concealer. Okay. <laughs> oh, this, 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 this. I 
I see you do that, but I don't really know what that is. But And also, for anyone who's curious, Chelsea has let me do her makeup before. Okay. Another very nerdy thing about Chelsea is she loves Legos. <laughs> and part of her Christmas present was a 16-inch Yoda that is now in our living room. She already has the Hogwarts castle in its entirety completed in my office because she no longer has the same office space that I do, and now it's in my office. I do love Legos. Oh, yes, our best friend in the whole wide world, Beverly, Beverly. gave me this mug, and so I love it and have used it ever since she gave it to me. We have a problem. It says Pisces. I have forgotten the um, eyeliner. That's okay. Say hi, Bailey. Hi. Where are you? She was sleeping between my legs, so she's really mad that I woke her up. Okay. So one thing that I would love for us to do at some point is to be able to do a Q&A. That's one that I've always wanted to do. However, with, you know, all of the resubscribers, that's not really something we can realistically do. Hello there, nose highlight. Look at her. Yeah. So as we get more subscribers and more people who want to watch us and want to follow us and want to, like, be a part of our lives, um, that is something I would love. So if that becomes something that can happen, what I'll also do at the end of this video is I will link both of our social medias, my Instagram, her Instagram. We also have a joint Instagram, which is where I'll also post updates on these videos. We have a blog that we've written. We don't keep up with that, unfortunately, as much as, you know, I wish we did. Um, one thing we may also want to do is a house tour, because we live in a 120-year-old house, and it's huge sometimes, so maybe we'll do a house tour. What do you think? I think that would be a good idea. Yeah, I think that would be fun. Okay. Yeah. It's <clears throat> pretty much haunted, but we can talk yeah. about that later, too. Also, yeah, do you want to tell them our most recent haunted experience? So, my sister was sleeping upstairs, and I thought she had come downstairs to use the whole bathroom, and so I was in the kitchen, and I saw the bathroom door close and then open back up, and my sister was actually still upstairs. And we so. do have a ghost, but we're pretty sure it's a nice ghost. Okay. Time. Are you going to wing it? I am going to try to wing this thing so it can walk. Well, I'm excited to see. It's hard to do mascara. Okay, so here is what we ended <laughs> with. She did the contour. Look at that highlight, though. And she winged it out, which honestly, from far back, really doesn't look <laughs> that bad. So here's what we've got. Would you wear this out in public? What do we though? think? I would wholeheartedly. That's just because frankly, you love because me. I, and then because I don't care what people think about me. So. I, I wouldn't walk bad. into I wouldn't walk into an Ulta or a Sephora <laughs> with what I've got going on right now, but I would walk into a Walmart. Fair enough. Fair enough. So like I was talking about, we do want to do more videos. We do want to make this more of a, you know, every week thing for us. So for those of you that took the time out of your day to watch this, thank you. We really appreciate it. Leave a comment down below of things that you'd like to see in the future. Like I said, we want to do a Q&A. We'd like to do a house tour. We'll probably introduce the kiddos at one point because they are obviously a huge part of our lives. Um, but like, subscribe. If you like us that much and you want to hit the notification bell, just go ahead and do that. <laughs> um, but until then, this is the end of our first together video. Okay. Yes. Bye. Bye, Basil.